Okay, you guys. So I'll try to get everything into the house so I can show you what I've got. Mainly some, you know, greenery foliage. I don't know if this light works. A tree. Some baskets. I'll show it to you more in detail when I get everything in the house. Some bowls. Some books. Some DVDs. different from that one so yeah I'll get everything in the house and then I'll show it to you in more detail sorry about the background noise there's a lot of traffic again and I'll see you all in a bit hi so okay guys let's see we've got one Air Force, the RAF in the 1990s by Robert Jackson book. Loads of pictures and information. Still in very, very good condition. I don't see any particular rips apart from the edges here. Looks like a really good book. A weaved basket, a bit wet, but still it's a good size. Another wooden basket with the feet, so you can see it's got the feet bigger than this one obviously. And I like how rustic it looks. I think they were chucking it away because it's about to break. But if I put like ribbon around, you won't see that break. Clean it up a little bit, maybe paint it and it will look good, I think. Use as a display for flowers or you know, the rustic look that people are going for nowadays. So, put that basket and that one there. Look, we've got a Spitfire book. I think these books, I think they bought these in charity shops because of the tag. And they didn't want it anymore. This one has mostly black and white pictures. Again, doesn't look too bad. No missing pages. So that's good. Got another book. The fire aircraft in color. This one looks like it was on sale in the bookstore because that looks like a bookstore price tag. Got a clear stamper set by Inspirations. It's got the different kinds of flowers to and from ladybug, bird, bee, butterfly another one but this one's kind of like celebration stamps with the wedding flowers, birthday wishes drinks, balloons doesn't look like it's been opened a 
four disc edition transformer season three and four it's the animated one uh, that's why they chucked it because it was missing one but if we look it doesn't look too scratched just needs a bit of wipe Boys will still enjoy the other three. Then I've got this, I think it's a vase. Yeah. It's got the little bubble in the end too. That's pretty cool. And you've got a, what does that say? Pyrex, Pyrex dish, clear dish. I think that's for pie. I also got this box of, um, you know, the things that they put in hampers. So someone was chucking it away, so I could use that if I'm gonna make a hamper someday. A very dirty fish dish it is quite a big size for a fish just needs cleaning letter organizer in mesh A gold with a swirl fruit bowl. This is by Rosha John Rosha, which is a brand sold in Debenhams. Very posh. This one, I think, you know, those folders and this bit came off. I think I'm going to either use it or chuck it in the bin. <sighs> Don't know yet. This one is super heavy. Uh, needs a clean. It is a very, very big clear bowl with um, a stand has a very short stand to it. I like it because of the detail it has around the edges. You can see. That's why I got it because of the edging. It looks really, really nice. I, so far, do not feel any cracks on it. You've got this kitchen rules. Never go to bed mad or angry. Eat, drink, and be merry. Don't complain or you'll be cooking tomorrow. Season everything with love. A messy kitchen is a happy kitchen. No talking with your mouth full. Eat all your veggies. If you get it out, put it away. If it smells, throw it away. <laughs> I like that last bit <laughs> that's cool I love that last bit all right moving on we've got these butterfly stickers I think this one came from a shop but they didn't want it anymore I can always give that to some little girls I know a base like floral display with yellow flowers no bricks just very dirty this one I think I believe this one is a set they look like um, autumn mugs because of the color 
We've got the mugs and this must be for me. Milk. Four cups and a milk jug. There you go. Again, just dirty. No breaks. This is made in England. I like the pattern. Looks very nice. Again, just needs a clean. You guys know I like white, so I tend to, if I see it, then it's good, I'll get it. So this one is for toast. And just needs a clean again. Put that there. I think this is a vase. I like it because of the honeycomb pattern on the vase. And it's two-toned because of the different color of the base. Just look at that honeycomb. I wonder if I can remove those. Hmm. Yep. So that's a vase. I am not sure if this is brass, but looks like you can hang something to it. So yeah, can always put some foliage and hang it somewhere. A stapler that works. This one looks like a nativity scene. There's no significant break. Um, it retails for $7.99. It is a, when I see holes at the back, it serves as a tea light holder. So, yeah. So that's how that looks. Another clear bowl with um, circle dents on it. The dents are, don't know if you can see that, they're, it's pretty flat. There. Yeah. A Smurf set that would be good for my oldest son. Look. <laughs> this one's funny. I think it's for milk. A blue chicken milk jug. Tiny. Tiny jug. That's pretty cool. A clear bowl with compartments. I think this is two pieces. It, it, two different pieces. One is a bowl and one is just a server with compartment but it's stuck together so I'll try to sort that out later. This one looks 
like the tree. I think it's complete because it's got the other bits to it. Don't think it's a significantly big tree. But I can always cut these up and use it for garlands or a DIY if I do not like the size of the tree. Or I can always gift it to someone here in England. Who does. And lastly, this is just half a tree. I only got it because even if it doesn't have the, if you look at it, it doesn't have the bottom half. So even if it doesn't have the bottom half, I really, really like this. I can always cut it up to make a garland because garlands are very expensive and I think the amount of branches on this one can make me probably two garlands and this one is just a full plant and someone wrapped a lot of um, I'll probably chuck these away lights on it I see yeah someone just put a lot of lights on it give it a good wipe and I'm sure I can use it around my home so that is what the tree is looking like it's as tall as my radiator and half a tree and the bits that I have already shown you earlier thanks for watching after showing you what i got so i took the lights off and just put the free stuff that i found the shredded paper i did cut the boxes it came in i just ripped it up just so it can secure the tree so that is how it's looking like and I was able to separate the bowls so this is the one with the sectional divider and this is just the other bowl it's quite heavy with that um, diamond cut detail on the sides just thought I'd show you the bowls that were stuck together and the tree. Bye again!